The wheels no longer roll on my office chair. They are completely full of hair. So we're going to try and fix this. Before we go any further, take these measurements and go order new ones now because fixing these particular IKEA wheels sucks. They will be damaged. First, you need the length of the shaft and then you need the diameter of the shaft. On these ones, it's 20 by 10 millimeters. I should have just bought new ones. But if you're like me and you'd rather try and fix it before you spend money, then throw those things into a vise. I'm going to lock this down here, grab a couple of screwdrivers, cram them inside the housing here, and then I'm going to start to pry them apart. But before I start prying very hard, I'm going to take a cloth. I'm going to cover up that wheel because when these let go, they're going to go everywhere. Trust me, this is experience. This is not the first wheel that I took apart. And it's not the first attempt that I've done either. I tried to use drain cleaner and vinegar and those both did not work. Now, once this hairball disgusting mess of disgustingness is is off the housing we're going to cut it out with pliers that's right this hair is so thick it needs pliers once i'm finished cutting this stuff out i'm going to clean up the housing as well and to put the wheels back together you guessed it you just press them back together and they should snap in but if you bought new ones you don't have to do this so just buy new ones And hey, why not stick around, watch the rest of the video, and see how I failed to clean the hair out of these wheels using drain cleaner. That's right, highly corrosive chemicals to eat the hair from around the wheels. I put it in a plastic container, shook it up every couple of hours, and a day later, yep, didn't work. Took a lot of hair away, but the hair that was binding things up, still in there. So, drain cleaner, not great. Corrosive, dangerous. Wear gloves. Wear safety glasses. Don't use it. Buy new wheels.